All right, before we get started with halftime, let's talk some WNBA. The Dallas Wings will have the number one pick in the 2025 WNBA draft after winning the league's draft lottery on Sunday. The Los Angeles Sports will select second, followed by the Chicago Sky and the Washington Mystics. The Wings and the Sky had a combined 45% chance of earning the top pick, and the Sparks' probability to win the lottery was 44 and the Mystics down to 10.4%. It will be the franchise's first number one overall pick since 2021 when Dallas selected Charlie Collier from the University of Texas. Wheezy, will Paige go to Dallas, number one overall? You bet him. Of course. Why not? Mm-hmm. The, we, the Wings were played with injury this year, guys. Um, Mike Satu Sabale, the only person that they had that was really active every game was Arika Ogumbawale, coach. So, how you feel about them going number one? They better take her. I don't give a damn who was hurt. Yeah. You go get Paige, put on the back court with Arike, mm-hmm. and now it's, it's must see TV. Mm-hmm. But what I'm interested to see is what the expansion Golden State Vacres is going to do at five. Mm-hmm. I know to be based on what happens with the expansion draft that's coming up December 6th. Right. Because they'll get to pick from all the teams that are yeah. available. But I'm very interested to see what they're going to do at five to go with these players they're going to bring in from the expansion draft. And each WNBA team is only able to keep four players. Right. They yeah. can take yeah. four players that they can't pick from. Yeah. Now, Jeff, the Wings announced that they fired their coach that took them to the semifinals two years ago. They still don't have a coach right now. How you feel about their chances going into 2025? The job just got that much more attractive. That's right. Because you 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 got the, the person you need. You got the person you want. Mm-hmm. This is this is the league shifting pick of this draft. There's, one, there's another one coming the year after. Yeah. This is the one for this year. And, right. and you get that player. So shout out to Paige, man. Paige Buckets. Now, Paige wanted originally to go to Los Angeles. I mean, that was Who her wouldn't? preferred destination. Yeah. Her and, um, uh, what's her name? Which young lady that got drafted there last year. Cameron Brink. Cameron, Cameron Brink. That'd yeah. be great. For Kia Jackson is Kia Jackson, yeah, that'd yeah. be great. Yeah, I bet you. I know that's I right. Know that's right. But the Wings <laughs> don't have a coach. Yeah. I'm worried of seeing Arike and Paige. Can they play together? Because, you know, Caitlin went into a situation where the yeah. big was there. Yeah. They just needed a point guard. And she was the point guard, and yeah. it just kind of worked. You move Kelsey Mitchell to the two. Arike that took needs, time. They both need the ball in their hand. That took time for for uh, the fever. Yeah. We saw that. Um, mm-hmm. I think with Paige, though, she comes in with that respect of her peers. Like Paige is one of the ones. Paige was the anointed one when she was I think she's better than Caitlin Clark. But, but you know, she was. She, but she was. No, she is. She's a reason why. There's a reason why we knew who Paige was in high school. Mm-hmm. You know, let's be honest. So mm-hmm. so she has that respect of her peers. She's going to have to work for it as well. Yeah. I don't think. I understand what you're saying as far as the backcourt and needing the ball. I yeah. think that's going to work itself out. People don't forget that. Please pay attention. Paige Beckers was the number one player in the class. Yeah. She won freshman. As a freshman, she won player of the year. Yeah. Kaylin Clark was a freshman that year. Yeah. So in turn, Paige tears her ACL. Then the emergence of Kaylin Clark happens. Paige Beckers is a better basketball player all around than Kaylin Clark. Yeah, but you say the emergence happens, but Kaylin Clark is no slouch. I never said that. No, no, I'm not saying. No, I'm not saying you said that. But you saying the emergence happened like it would happen. But yeah, Kaylin so, Clark was hooping. Yeah, but Paige didn't play that year, so it, it had to be one. So in turn, when they he's saying Paige would have played. It would have been the same. Paige has been kill. Paige has been a killer her entire life. I think she's a better basketball player. It's just me. Okay. So yeah. my question is, oh, who's tanking for Juju? Ain't no tanking. Ain't no tanking. They can't tank. Yeah, it's hard to tank in that. Yeah, hard to tank. Yeah, Juju is the prospect, though. Yes, she is. She got to, she got to do like two more years, right? Allegedly, oh, just one more. She can leave after her this dream. year, and then this year, year. year after. She She'll be eligible for the NBA draft, WNBA draft for next year. That's right. Yeah. All right, you guys. Smart press. Hey, it's your man, Coach Lock. Y'all make sure y'all check out the Full Sport Press Podcast every Monday, wherever you stream your podcast episodes. Like I always say, get a drummer song. Revolution will be podcasted.